all cleaned out down to the dirt. So now, next step. Burn lime. Here we go. And we are complete. Hopefully y'all clean up a little bit after getting a little muddy. But after a long day, welcome to the Leghorn Pen. So since starting this video, um, coming up on about two weeks now of the process of moving the leghorns from their grow out pen to their official breeding pen, it was a long process. It took a couple days to get it, everything situated because while you can see some in the video, it's a long process to scrape everything out of a pen and make sure everything has been bleached and sanitized from the previous birds that were in here and taking everything down to the dirt and putting in fresh bedding wrapping the pens with hardware cloth from top to bottom for predators um, so there's a lot of extra details that go into um, moving the birds around at least on our farm because we want to make sure they are very well taken care of they got what they need they're well protected um but also making it simple for us and simple and easy to maintain is very important but you also want to make sure that um, everybody's happy everybody's healthy happy hens and i want to show you guys how much they've grown since the first clip in the video you can see how small they were in their little grow out pen and these guys are about four and a half months old now and they've like doubled in size just in the two weeks of getting them into a much bigger area and having you know room to run around and you know, we've got the, we try to use natural resources around here, natural perches. So, you know, trees that have fallen down, I use as natural roosts, but I turn this around. They've pushed all the bedding out that way, but you can see how much bigger they've gotten. Happy. They've brightened up a good bit. They're a lot cleaner. So... This was a, a success. I think they're much happier. And I cannot wait until they start laying. And I need to come up with a name for this fella here. I don't like a foghorn, leghorn. That's so typical. But he needs a name. He's a pretty boy. I mean, he's, we've got one boy in here one rooster to all these hens so we might have to thin them out a little bit when they start laying depending on how the fertility goes but that was just a quick recap of moving the leghorns from their grow out pen to 
braider pin and I'm sure in the next few weeks I'll be doing the same thing with the Delaware babies and I'll go over that process again and that'll be a whole new one because we'll have to put a whole new pen together for them so we'll definitely do a video on that one so happy leghorns happy hands happy mama happy chicken mama everybody's happy and healthy